newest season of The X Factor continued on Saturday night, kicking off with a lesson great acts, but followed by a slew of success stories that wowed Louis Walsh, Nicole Scherzinger, Simon Cowell, and Sharon Osbourne. Set at Thor Park, which gave the judges, and Dermot O'Leary, the chance to hit the roller coasters on their downtime. The show saw the first group of the 2017 stand on the infamous X's new Dynamix put on Gary audition, impressing enough to be sent through to boot camp. But Talia Dean proved to be one of the standout stars of the night, surprising Nicole and Sharon in particular. The 32, who is a VIP airport concierge from Hounslow, surprised the panel when she informed both Sharon and Nicole that she had met them before on their way to flights, and carry their bags. You don't remember me do you? She teased, leaving them wondering as she was thought after telling them, they both came up and they had been rude to her, which she swiftly insisted they hadn't. She also revealed that they both encouraged her to follow her dreams and, indeed, audition on The X Factor. After a hug from Nicole she sang Nina Simone's I put a spell on you and impressed all four judges to be sent through to the next round. Why are you working at the airport? Asked Louis. Thought you better be carrying your own bags to boot camp, kid, because it's a yes from me. Nicole joked. <music> Frenchman Kevin Davy White, a 29 year old full time musician from Paris, who's been living in London for the past year with his other half, sang James Brown's Man's World and sailed through to the next round too. You are effortless, talented, and born to sing, Louis told Kevin. I like you a lot as a person too, said Sharon. Nicole rounded it off with a wee, 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 to make him feel at home. Rebecca Grace, a 22 year old drive through restaurant worker from Essex, had the judges in cheer when she performed Kelly Clark's and Steve Batiste. Supported outside by her parents and girlfriend. Samuel Shepard, a 22 year old caravan salesman and originally from Devon, was born in but failed to get through. Also unsuccessful was 18 year old child care worker. Fashion blogger and model from Newcastle, Issy, who gave a lackluster performance of Justin Timberlake's Senorita. There were a pair of drag acts as well as a cabaret performer on the show, but, despite commanding attention, were deemed not right for the X Factor. A pair of identical twins who, despite being aesthetically pleasing, could neither sing, dance nor rap, were also featured. Riding on the fact that people say they look like Justin Bieber, the boys, called Pretty Boy Carmen, real names Achilles and Philip, performed a rendition of the Canadian singer's hit Boyfriend. However, their performance was grand and dreadful by the judges after the tone to some 19 years old, proved to be toned deaf.
despite telling Simon Cowell that they aspired to be big and have a clothing brand as well. They didn't have the musical talent to get them very far. You make Jedward look like Simon and Garfield. Put Lou Walsh as Sharon Osborne and Nicole Scherzinger and Sister they get vocal training. The three judges all told the boys no but when it came to Simon's turn they made a faux pas. It's four yeses, he said, meaning to say four no's apostrophe dot the shock with it wins, as well as the other judges, only for Simon.